Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Nicola and I'm from South Wales. If you're new here, if you've been here before, then welcome back to you. Um, today I've got a Tesco delivery that I've just had. So what I'll do is show you everything that I bought and then at the end I'll show you the receipt and tell you what the total is because if you've been watching before, you probably know that I try to stick to a budget between two shops. So for instance, this now Tesco's and Iceland was a shop I did a couple of days ago that you might or might not have seen on your already. So I try and stick to around £80 if I can, but definitely under £100. I don't like going over £100 between the two shops. So sometimes that could be Asda or you know somewhere else I have done Morrison's before um yeah but I always tend to do an Iceland one so I'll show you all that at the end and tell you if I have stayed in budget or not this week so um I've had four of my usual semi-skimmed six pinters for you all be you so they were one pound fifty each and then I've had two lots of this chicken breast fillets three pound fifty for a pack, 650 grams. So I'm gonna do, um, you might have seen the peppercorn sauce, the Bisto peppercorn sauce that I've had from Iceland. That was so, so nice. So I've got some of that. So I'll probably do uh, this with some potatoes and peppercorn sauce one night. And I don't know, maybe a curry or something. I haven't decided too much. Um, And then underneath here then is just two of the uh, minced beef then which I'm going to do a bolognese and possibly a lasagna this week then so that's kind of four sort of meals anybody that doesn't want it then I will see what else they fancy and doing so because my my younger son he tends to like having something different sometimes so um then I had some of these cream fields yogurts then two strawberry raspberry and two cherry they were 73 pence. They were substituted. I did order a different choice, but um, very similar they are. So that's fine. And then two lots of these pots of joy. So I think these ones have been around for quite a while, the caramel. I'm sure I've seen them. Don't think we've had them before. I know we definitely haven't had these chocolate brownie flavour. It does say new on these ones, but they were both on offer for a pound. So... um. Yeah, brownie flavour and a layer. So I was kind of hoping it would be brownie kind of, you know, a bit like the layers of joy things. But uh, yeah, we'll give them a go. Like the cream egg ones we've had before were lovely. And then the normal kind of chocolate ones are lovely too. So yeah, seeing as they were off a pound each. And then we haven't tried these before, I don't think. Breaded chicken goujons, hearty food core. They're one pound five p for two sure sizes, two hundred seventy gram. So yeah, I thought we'd give those a go. Um, that's something like my son might have when we'd have something like uh, lasagna or something which he doesn't like. So yeah, the the reviews on those were good. So hopefully they will be nice. And then two more packs of this chicken tikka breast slices, which my older son loves. So they were a pound each. And then, oh, there was a hole in there then. Oh, it's not. Um, and then a pack of these Red Mere Farm baby potatoes. Uh, they were the cheapest. I'm not sure how much they were. I think they were about 80p. I'll show you at the end anyway. But yeah, they were the cheapest for one kg bag so that was good and then just two packs of these jacket potatoes then 39p there's four jacket potatoes in there and then onto bread then on my new bread bin you might have noticed had this today um <laughs> uh yeah so i've had a, a pack of hovis but i did order a tiger bread so that was out of stock so they've sent this hovey soft white instead so yeah i just i just kept it because we needed some bread and then some of the wraps then the neville's whole meal wraps were there too and then some of these hearty food core potato croquettes the 61p for those frozen ones 
And the only other frozen items I had was two bags of the crushed ice, which is a pound each, uh, yeah, per bag. So I've put them in the freezer already. Um, and that was all the frozen then. And then I spotted these then, the Fanta Raspberry, is it Raspberry? Yeah, Fanta Raspberry, there's eight cans there for 2 .99. So I thought the children might like those. So that was a good uh, zero sugar as well. So that's good. So yeah, two ninety nine for eight of those. I thought they could have a try of those. Because they do like, I think it was the Fanta grape we had before. And they like that. So yeah, I haven't noticed these ones there before. But they may may not be new. Um, and then I had two jars of the hot chilli sauce. That was 80 pence each. Two jars of the bolognese sauce, they were 65p each. And then a pack of the usual spaghetti, but they're then hearty food for 20p. Then these chunky chocolate cookies were substituted. I did order just the usual ones, um, but they sent these instead. So that's fine. They charged me a pound. I don't know if that's what they were, but and then um Tesco's really need to stop putting these on offer because <laughs> they're 80p at the moment and they have been for a few weeks now and since I realised that I like them, um, well we all do, um, I'm getting two boxes a week. So yeah, they're normally £1.60 but at the moment they're 80p. So I wouldn't buy them if they were £1.60 for one box. But I don't mind paying £1.60 for two boxes. So yeah, so Tesco's <laughs> need to put them back to full price and I'll stop buying them then. <laughs> but yeah, but they are really nice. Um, and then these Jaff cakes then, uh, mainly my daughter likes these, but everybody really likes them. Uh, £1.50 on offer for a triple pack. Not bad. And then some more of the chocolate pillows, £1.10 for those. The lemonade but there is just the 17 pence sugar-free one, which is really nice. And then, I haven't noticed these before, it does say they are new, so that's probably why. Aero Chocolate Caramel. Now, I did think, because I don't read things always properly, uh, I just kind of think, ooh, that looks nice when put in the basket. But it does say, I thought maybe there'd be a little bit of caramel in there, but it, it doesn't look like, it says somewhere I read that it's just, um, oh, the caramel flavoured bubbles. Yeah, it says somewhere. Yeah. Caramel flavoured bubbles. So I was thinking it could actually be some caramel in there. But I thought something different for children, everybody needed to try. Uh, they were a pound on offer. Um, and then some coffee crisp then. I think they were 98p. Turkish delights were about the same. And then some of the cosmic whips like Milky Way, 85p roughly. And then some more chocolate oranges because you just can't not can you, when they're uh, 99p. So two of those. And then oh, another silly thing I did then. Um, well, I mean the arrows weren't silly really, but these mini cheddars sticks. Uh, I haven't seen these before. And we definitely haven't bought them anyway. Um, Rich and Tangy Cheddar, they were £1.99, they were on offer for a pound. But when I looked at them, I thought that they were like the, you know, the big bags where they give you like six, is it six or eight little bags inside. So I thought, oh, everybody can have a bag of those. But it's not, it's just one bag of like sticks, you know, once you open it, that's it. So, yeah, oh, there we are, perfect to share with family and friends. So, yeah, maybe they'll have to be one night and just put it in a bowl or something and uh, everybody try some. But, yeah, I didn't look at that properly, but I'll let you know what they're like. And then I just had some of these sun bites. We've had the, uh, I think, is it the sweet chilli sun bites we've had before? We haven't tried these ones, a honey glazed barbecue. So, they were a pound on and off that as well. And that's the only crisps I got this week because we still got a few crisps in the cupboard. And then just non-food then, all I needed was some cotton beds. These were 40 pence for 200 of those. 
and then some motion up liquid this was 33p so that's real good some more of the lime uh, shower gel for a pound some more toilet tissues nine of those one pound 90 and then i didn't have room so i had to go up here now <laughs> and i got two um jumbo kitchen towels but there i only remember putting one in the basket so i don't know whether uh i must have added added an extra one but actually i'm glad because we could do with another one because i completely ran out so yeah that was everything then so what i'll do now i'll show you the receipt and the total and yeah you can see some of the substitutions but there and then the total came to 56 pounds 16 but i always take off the service charge delivery three pound uh so you'll see then tesco's really i rounded it off to 53 pound iceland i rounded that off to 37 i mean it, it was more or less um around that um just because i wanted to make it a round number <laughs> so the total was 90 pound for this week so under my 100 10 pound over my 80 10 pound under my 100 so i'm happy with that do you know what i mean it's not it's not too bad i mean you know i've got a few things here to make meals now like i said bolognese lasagna chicken peppercorn sauce and bits and bobs breakfast sandwiches you know bits and bobs um i would say plenty of milk but you if you watch before there probably isn't plenty of milk i'll probably have to uh get some somewhere else but yeah all in all not too bad i don't think so yeah that is everything so um next week now i'm gonna try my hardest to get it to 80 pounds children back in school next week and well we'll be back in school by the time you see this now um so yeah i mean well some of this is for when they're back in school but you know it's like when children are home and things and everybody's home like everybody seems to go through through things quicker but i'm gonna try cross fingers try next we can get it to around 80 but i don't think 90 is too bad is it for five of us anyway so i hope you're all okay hope you've been enjoying this lovely weather hope when you see this the weather's still lovely and i'm gonna go and put all this away now and might treat myself to a caramel bar with a mug of hot chocolate so <laughs> i will see you all in my next video so take care bye